now, Mr. Hell, before we move to things about, I want you to explain to Mr. Henderson about what you saw yesterday morning when you come here. By the way, has anything been moved? Are things just as you left them yesterday? Uh, just the same. When it dropped uh, below zero, last night I thought I'd better uh, Send Frank out this morning to make uh, I think make a fight for us. Okay. Uh, no use getting like a pneumonia with a big case on. Uh, do you see it? But I told him not to touch anything except the stove. So and you know the Frank. Mm. Somebody should have been left here yesterday. Oh, yesterday when I had to send Frank to Maori Center. For that man who went crazy, yeah, I want you to know that I had my hands full yesterday. Okay. I knew you could get back from Omaha by today, and as long as I went to over, I went over everything here myself. Okay, well, Mr. Hale, tell just what happened when you came here yesterday morning. I guess we'll go upstairs okay. first, and then out to the bar, okay. and then we go around there. Okay. So you're convinced that there are nothing important here that would point to any motive? Mm, nothing here, but in the kitchen things, I think. Hmm. Here's a nice mess. Can you be the woman and hope for a murder and worrying about her reserves? I guess before we go, she may have something more serious about her reserves. Mm, well, women are just worrying over trifles. And yet, for all of their worries, what would we do without the ladies, right? Okay. Dirty towels. Not much of a housekeeper, won't you say? There's a great deal of work to be done on the farm. And to be sure, and yet, I know there are some recent county farmhouses which do not have such dirty towels. The snow will get dirty awful quick. Men's hands aren't always as clean as they, they are. Mm. Loyal to yourself, I see. But you and Mrs. Wright were neighbors. I suppose you were friends too. I've not seen much of her of late year, and I've not been here in this house. It's more than a year. And why was that? Did you like like her? I, I like her all well enough. Farmer's wife have their hands full, Mr. Henderson, and then mm, yes, mm, they never see a very cheerful place. No, it's not cheerful. I shouldn't say she had the homemaking instinct. Well, I don't know as right head either. You mean that they did not go on very well? No, I don't mean anything, but I don't think a place be any cheerfuler for John Wright's being in it. Well, I'd like to talk more on that a little later, but I would like to get the layout things upstairs, I think. Okay. I suppose anything, Mrs. Peters. And she will be alright, I think. And she was to take the uh, to take in some clothes maybe for her, you know, and a few little days we left in uh, such a such a hurry today. Okay. I would like to see what you take, Mrs. Peters. And please keep an eye out of anything that might be important or of use to us, okay? Yes, Mr. Henderson. Miss Peter, yes, Mrs. Hill. Do you think she did? I don't know. Well, I don't think she did. Asking for an 
upon and her little child and worrying about her toilet. Evil look back on her and Mr. Henderson, Henderson is all full sarcastic in speech and he will make fun of her when, say, when she saying she didn't wake up. Well, I guess John Wright didn't wake up when they were sleeping the alarm under his neck. No, it is strange. He must have been the craft, craftly and still. They say it was such a funny way to kill a man, bridging it all up like that. That just what Mr. Hell said. There was a gun in the house, and he says that what he can understand. Mr. Henderson said coming out that blood was needed for the case was a motive, something to so angel or sunny feeling. Hmm. Well, I don't see any sign of anger around here. It's wiped to here, outside the bread box. I wonder how they are finding things upstairs. I hope she had a little more read up up there and you know it's it seems kind of sneaking. Look locking her up in town and then coming out here and trying to get her on house to turn against her. But Mr. Hell, the law is the law. Hmm I suppose it. Better lose up your things, Miss Peter. You won't feel them when we go out. She was pressing up cute. It's so pretty. Pattern. Pretty, isn't it? Yes. I wonder if she was going to kick or just nod it. I think that they just wonder if she was going to kill it or just not it. <laughs> yeah. Thanks why I didn't do much up there, did it? Let's go out to the barn and get that bit up. Okay. Why? This isn't her scissors. Oh, Miss Peters, it's... It's the bird. But Miss Peter, look at it. It's neck. It's all other side too. Somebody wrong. It's snake. Have you decided whether she was going to hurt it or kill it? Uh, do you think uh, she was going to knock it? Mm. I, I think that's interesting. I'm sure. Has the bird flow? We think the, the cat got it. Is there a cat? You know, they live. Hmm. Okay. Well, no signs of anyone coming in from outside. It's their own road. And I think we will go upstairs and go over it again piece by piece. Okay, let's go. She liked the bird. She was going to bury it in that pretty box. I think I'm going to stay here a while by myself. You can sign back up for me, can't you? I want to go over everything again. Yeah. I'm not satisfied that we can do better. Do you want to see what Mrs. Peter could be taking? Mm, I don't think the ladies have picked out anything dangerous. I don't think Mrs. Peters need any supervising. And um, Mrs. Peters, you are married to the law. And you ever think of that? Uh, not just that way. Maybe to the love. Uh, I just want you to come to here for a minute or so. I want to take a look at these windows. Oh, windows? Yes. What? Now that she was not going to kill it. Yeah, she was going to. What is it you call it, Mrs. Hale? Um, we call it not it, Mr. Henderson. Hello, my name is Jesslyn Gunawan. I am as the county attorney. Hello, my name is Rigo Nasari, as a sheriff. Hello, my name is Peter Madani, as Miss Hale. Thank you so 
much for watching. Thank you. Bye bye. Kalau nak agak geser sini, agak geser ke sini, agak mepet nak. Di bawah aja, bawah. Sini. Kok aku ketawa sih? Bye-bye! <laughs>